Let's get into NEM3. Number one, if we're gonna fully understand net metering three, we have to be willing to take emotions out. Number two, we have to look at the perspective of not what is best for solar, but rather what is best for the energy infrastructure. Sometimes in the solar industry, it's very easy to paint the utilities to be these bad guys. In some ways they can be, but we have to be honest and understand that we need the utilities. We need the power lines. We need transformers and distributors without the power lines we can't do solo the third one we have to understand that what is happening in california will happen to everybody in their market if solar does what it's supposed to be doing meaning if you're selling in texas guess what one day this will happen to your market so we can't look at this as a bad thing but rather as a thing that is inevitable the fourth one change is hard anything is hard but it's always good in the long run i was in solar when we were in net metering one and when we transitioned to net metering two people freaked out guess what solar in California thrived under net metering too.